control <laughs> What's going on guys, Mr. Clasher here. Welcome back to another Pokemon Go video. In today's video, guys, I'll be talking about the brand new update that's going to be coming out relatively soon, I'm guessing. And there are a couple things that are going to be coming. So, first of all, it says earn a new capture bonus to increase the odds of a pretty much catching a rare Pokemon. I'm not going to read this whole thing. Basically, to sum it up, guys, let's say you catch, like it says, the Kindler, the Psyog, the or the Gardener. And if you catch, like, a Flying type, a a grass type you know a flying type or a normal type any kind of pokemon it's going to have a higher chance and you're going to build up um metals towards catching a pokemon and that's what that's pretty much going to do is let you catch the same type of pokemon or similar types of pokemon in a higher chance so basically it says here these new bonuses will give you a better chance of capturing pokemon with a related type pretty much what i just said for example as you catch a higher tier for the kindler Metal your bonus to catch fire type Pokemon such as Charmander, the Vulpix, and the Pinata increases. So if you do catch like let's say five fire type Pokemon, you're gonna have a higher chance of catching more of them as the update goes on and as you keep playing Pokemon Go. Um, and it says here trainers can work their way to a new tier by catching many Pokemon of the same type, which is pretty nice. So let's say you catch a lot of Pidgeys. And eventually you're going to unlock a Pidgeotto. It's going to spawn. The Pidgeotto is going to spawn more often. And then if you catch a lot of those, I'm going to guess the Pidgeot spawns more. So I think that's how the process goes. If you catch a, a lot of the same type of Pokemon, it's going to move up as like the next level up of the Pokemon, the next evolution. So I think um, it says here, if a Pokemon has multiple types, your bonus will be the average of your bonuses for each type. For example, Pidgey is both normal and flying type. So your bonuses in this case would be the average of the normal type and the flying type. So that's pretty cool. And you do get medals by catching them. Here are some screenshots of the Pokemon Go. Um, pretty much what it says right here and pr pretty much what the examples will be. So I'm so excited for this new update. Now, I'm not exactly sure when this new update is going to be coming. Hopefully, it's pretty soon because we just got the details not too long ago. And you guys can see these are the examples of how it's going to look like. So I think that's, uh, I know that's a water type Pokemon, fire type Pokemon. I'm not sure what that type of Pokemon is. Uh, some sort of metal, but yeah, that's the water, that's the fire type. And that's pretty much it. So I think this is going to help a lot of players catch more rare Pokemon. So I'm going to close and I'm going to open up the app. Um, but this is going to let the players that have been playing Pokemon catch more rare Pokemon. And this game has been released, I believe, in 31 countries. Oh, wow. There's a star near my park. That is pretty sweet. Um, I don't get those too often, but... Uh, if you guys can go to my Pokemon and some of the Pokemon I'll give you guys an example for. So I do catch a lot of Eevee. So what's going to happen is since I catch a lot of Eevee, eventually maybe a Jolteon is going to pop up, maybe a Flareon or even a Vaporeon. One of those three might show up if I catch like 10, 15, 20 of these type of Pokemon. That's pretty much what I'm kind of getting into, guys. Because I've had a lot, I mean, total, I've had probably over easily 150 candy i've just evolved a lot of eevees and stuff as you guys can see it towards the top i have the vaporeon i have two of them actually i have one snorlax i've got the flareon the hypno the scyther the jolteon and all those good pokemon so also the charmeleon i'm still working on that but it's going to take a while till i have a hundred uh fire type or i guess a hundred charmander candies but uh that's pretty much it guys so this new update is going to be like it's not going to be huge but it's going to help players find more rare pokemon that haven't found before and have a hard time catching more rare pokemon so shelter i'm almost done with the shelter i need five more candies and i think i'm going to sell my cloister which is going to be four more candy so um, hopefully I can get a 433 I'm gonna guess I'm gonna get like a 8 to a 900 cloister which I will definitely take so anyway in the comment section below tell me what you guys think about the new update that's gonna be coming again it's on Pokemon Go Niantic's lab.com website too if you guys want to read this whole thing go for it there are some examples as I showed you guys but anyway if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys smash the like button and as always I'll see you all on the next video